welcome back to my channel. We're gonna start a new vlog, September vlog, getting ready for fall, doing all the things. So it's currently Tuesday, and I figured I would pick up the camera because I don't have like a crazy week, which is kind of why I wanted to vlog, just to take you guys along. A normal work week, I absolutely am obsessed with this time of year, as I feel like most people are. It's been so gorgeous here in the Midwest. The weather in Cleveland has been spectacular. We've just had one gorgeous day after the next. So it's just been making every day so great. It's currently around 2.30. I've been doing a lot of like shooting in my apartment with content, changed my sheets, did a bunch of laundry, cleaned. I'm actually having one of my girlfriends over tonight for a little wine and cheese to catch up. So I wanted to make sure the apartment was like super clean for her. So I'm about to head over to my parents' house because we are gonna shoot some fall looks. I just need some help with taking some pictures and filming some stuff. Um, so I just threw on like a little white t-shirt and jeans, super casual on my Hermes sandals because it's still like 80 degrees outside, but I just have like touches of fall. This is the cutest thing. This is from Amazon and it's actually not a sweater. It just has like a little, almost like, we call it a bib kind of because it looks like a bib, um, but it comes in a bunch of different colors and it's perfect if you live someplace warm so you don't want to like throw a huge chunky sweater over your shoulders and kind of like overheat, but you still want this look. So I'll leave a link down below. I also have it in black and white and it comes in like a bunch of colors. So I've been loving it for these hot, hot days where I still want to dress in like warmer tones. My earrings are J. Crow. Heading over to my parents' house to shoot some looks. They're actually in the process, starting the process of moving. So movers were there yesterday and this morning. So it was kind of crazy over at the house. So I'm gonna head over. So I'm going over in the afternoon, but I'm just gonna take you ladies along. Subscribe if you're new, and I'm so excited for this little week in my life. Okay, hi friends. So I'm currently shooting some fall looks with mom. We just took a really cute picture in this J. Crew outfit, which will be linked on my Instagram. I will also put it in the description box. It's just a little perfect for, again, I got a lot of requests for warm weather fall, so I felt like this would be the perfect little outfit. You could also wear this out. So I'm just wearing a white t-shirt, this little vest from J. Crew, and this matching black skirt, and then black loafers. My new favorite purse from J. Crew for the fall. And the same earrings I had. So we're gonna go home now, and I'm just going to try and film a few more reels. And yeah, that's the update. So I just shot, I just shot like five fall looks from J. Crew. I did a reel and then my mom and I went and took a picture. So got everything done that I wanted to today. I'm in this really cute little lady jacket with this green sweater and these amazing brown leather pants. Everything will be on my Instagram if you want to check it out and shop it. I'm gonna put my clothes back on and now I'm gonna to head to the grocery store and get all the accoutrements for this evening. Like I said, I'm having one of my girlfriends over for some wine and cheese, so I wanna make a really cute autumnal board, so I figured we could do that together. All right, I just got to our little local grocery store and I'm gonna run in and get some stuff for my cheese board i feel like i haven't made a cheese board in actually years so this is going to be fun just a couple things for two of us and then my mom had a bottle of prosecco that she's giving me from the house so let's go pick out some cheeses for tonight Okay, I'm back in my apartment and I just put together the cheese board for my girlfriend Peyton who should be over here shortly. She's just um, coming straight from work. So we're just gonna have some wine and cheese and ketchup. So I wanted to show you guys the spread that I did for the two of us when I was at the grocery store. Everything that I was getting, I was like, this is not gonna be enough. And then it ended up filling up my entire cheese board so well. So that is, it's honestly like we're not gonna finish this, but I think I'm gonna bring it over tomorrow night because my boyfriend and I are having dinner at his house. So I'm gonna make like a mini cheese board for the two of us tomorrow night. So this will definitely last you a few days, but for the sake of like filling up the cheese board, I'm glad that I got this much because it looks beautiful. Okay, so this is how it turned out. Again, like I said at the grocery store, I felt like I didn't have enough, but this was plenty. So I am using my new scalloped wood two home cheese board. They actually gifted this to me, so I'm gonna leave a link. They gave me so many new pieces for my apartment, so I'm finally using this cheese board. I think it's perfect for all year round, but it's definitely giving like all the fall vibes. And that scallop detailing just adds such a level of femininity that I love, especially for 
my apartment this would make for a wonderful gift as we head into the holiday season so like i said i'll leave a link a really easy tip for your autumnal boards is to just go to the grocery store and when you're picking up everything else grab a white pumpkin put that in the middle of your board and then just flank everything else around it and it instantly just makes it so much more one autumnal but two very elevated so that was my mom's idea so when I was at the grocery store, just like my local grocery store, um, they obviously had them. So I picked one up and then I just do three different cheeses. So I have my smoked Gouda, I have Brie, and then I got some already like pre-cut cheese just so it's easy to pick up. And I kind of separated those. I like to have a lot of different shapes. I feel like there's kind of a lot of roundness on this board, but that's okay. I have olives. I have these really good everything but the bagel crisps. These are gluten-free. And then I have some already pre-cut meats that I just got and they were already like all ready to go so that was nice some rosemary roasted olives i have these um i think they're like apricot crackers very autumnal just some plain like salted crackers and yeah that's pretty much it so it's not a whole lot but it looks really pretty and i think this will be more than enough for two people i also have these really cute cocktail napkins that my mom gave me that are fun for Halloween and I thought that this kind of looked like Mackenzie Child so very whimsical and then the other day when I was at Trader Joe's I picked up a bottle of like seven dollar white wine so that was chilled and we're gonna drink that I also just liked the bottle I thought it was pretty then I have my two wine glasses out which are from home goods I love the like detailing of them I thought they were such good finds so Peyton should be here any minutes I'm gonna go down and get her I also have some like jazz in the background autumnal jazz on my TV. I need to get speakers, but I've just been like playing it off of my TV. So yeah, it's Tuesday evening. This is just gonna be so fun to catch up. I'll leave links and just feeling like very inspired again to entertain and to do fun things like cheese boards and stuff. And like I said, I'll probably take the rest tomorrow night and make a little one at my boyfriend's house. Okay, Peyton just left. We had a great time. She was here from like six to 9.30. And I wanted to show you guys what she got me for my apartment. She brought a bottle of wine, this little housewarming gift. Um, and then she also brought me, she also brought me some hydrangea uh, napkins for the bathroom. And then this really adorable marble tray with these gold handles. And I was just telling her that as I was setting up, I felt like I didn't have a small tray um, this size. So I'm so excited about this. And she had it all wrapped up, but I just undid it. So that was so sweet of her. And I just cleaned up the cheese board, wiped down the coffee table, put everything back. And I'm about to run the dishwasher, but it was so nice catching up with Peyton. I've been friends with her since I was five and she was four and her moms have been friends for years as well. So, um, she was just filling me in on all of, she actually started a new job. So I was hearing about that, but just a very fun, Tuesday evening. I'm in a shower and get into bed. I changed my sheets today, so I'm excited to get into some fresh sheets. Tomorrow, Laura comes over for our Wednesday work day, which should be fun. And yeah, just gonna have another really productive and good Wednesday, and tonight was so fun. Okay, hello friends, happy Wednesday. I am up and ready to go for the day. I am about to head out and go over to my parents' house because it's a Wednesday work day with Laura. If you guys are new to my videos, Laura works on the Emily on Bose team. She comes over about once a week and we work for a couple hours on content, mood boards, you know, sourcing clothes, um, products for the new line, things like that. So this is what I'm wearing. We all always like to look super cute. I'm wearing this new cardigan that was actually gifted to me from Francis Valentine. This is part of their September drop and I'm actually a Francis Valentine ambassador. So I will leave the code for you guys in the description box because I think it gets you like 17% off or 20% off. It's a good chunk, um, and I love the little embroidered flower, and I just paired a striped t-shirt underneath it. My jeans are from Madewell, super comfortable. My flats are Sarah Flint, bringing my computer, my charger, and my Goyard, and then my earrings are Julie Boss, um, and so is my bracelet. My hair's a little poofy today, but that's okay. I'm gonna go grab and get coffee for all three of us because I think there's movers at my parents' house, so it's gonna be a little chaotic, so I figured I would just grab a coffee for everyone and have a really great day. Okay, hello friends. So it's still Wednesday, it's been a little later. Laura left at noon. We had a quick lunch, my mom and I, and now we are on quite the adventure. We just got to um, a place in Cleveland that has a bunch of Christmas decorations. We are here to pick out a Christmas tree for the new house and then look at ornaments, decor, kind of decide what direction we wanna go in. Um, but it's like a 
there's like it's like a showroom basically where mm -hmm. you can go and pick stuff out so i'm very excited for this little adventure i will try and get some clips once i'm in there but we've never been here before so it's gonna be fun i know okay this is what we are working with we've been pulling so many ornaments we're going with this like gold green blue this beautiful flower which i love um, we have this like little branch that we're gonna get so we're looking at either a 10 foot or a 12 foot tree the new house and this is kind of the color scheme we're going with and then filling in with like some white um, ornaments that we already have and some other things we already have but this is like a really cool like almost like a suede ornament so you just choose from all these right here it's super cool okay hello friends i just got back to my apartment for the day it's around 5 40. such a productive day had laura till noon went and got our whole christmas tree which is going to be absolutely stunning we ended up getting a 12 foot artificial christmas tree and then we got most of the ornaments because the tree is going to be so big we wanted to get like large extra large ornaments and this place had it um and we were able to get them all like wholesale it was just a cool experience and then after that my mom and i stopped by the new house and the cabinets were in my studio they're doing a ton of landscaping and then i was back over at my parents house just doing some stuff and then claire stopped by and they're going to dinner and then i'm going over to my boyfriend's house he's cooking dinner we do this like every wednesday he cooks dinner at his house and then we started the perfect couple which is such a good show on netflix with nicole kidman but we're watching it together so um we're gonna he's cooking dinner I think he's making steak and then we're gonna watch the perfect couple so i'm very excited for like a chill night and i'll probably change but i wanted to talk about we have been on a pillow hunt because i still feel like i need two throw pillows to kind of like tie in some blue to the living room we ordered some pillow covers from amazon last week and the blue was just too it almost looked like a highlighter blue like it, it wasn't right so we shipped those back and then we just ordered these new ones that hopefully will work from amazon so you and i are going to put them on the pillows together and decide if they're worth keeping because i kind of just like wanted to go with something from amazon so that I could share this and like you guys at home could also get the same pillows and they'd be like reasonably priced and stuff. Like that was my goal to begin with. And it can't always be like a hit or miss with Amazon, but normally like in the recent times, I feel like I, whatever I see in the picture pretty much always kind of like shows up. Obviously the quality is sometimes not amazing, but these pillow covers have been showing up looking completely different than the pictures. So even these were like, okay, this didn't exactly look like it, but they're pretty cute this is what they look like and i liked them because they're pulling in some green and blue so i'm gonna put these on the pillows and hopefully these work oh, i just ran into the wall and we're gonna see how they look on the chair and the couch also these inserts are super nice they were left over from i think our lake house they're from serena and lily so my mom gave them to me a good insert really does make all of the difference because if you invest in a nice insert, you could always be changing your pillow covers and it, it still looks really elevated. All right, I just got the pillows in. This is how they look. I think I like them, but I'm honestly not 100% sure. I like how the chairs are matching. I like how the pillows are matching. I still feel like I need something for that um, little side table, but what are your thoughts? Let me know. From afar, it's giving Serena and Lily, but up close, it's not. <laughs> so I can't decide if I like it or not. Also, while my mom was like cleaning out and moving, she found my J. Crew coffee table book that I got for Christmas. We had misplaced it and had been searching everywhere, but she finally found it, which I'm so happy because this also pulls in a little blue. So I'm going to undo this and place it. <laughs> That'll do it. <laughs>
back up the vlog camera. I kind of stopped vlogging the past two days because lots of crazy things are happening. So yesterday I actually had jury duty. So I got like the summons a couple weeks ago and then it was for this past Monday. Every day after four, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, I was calling in the evening and they didn't have they didn't need me to come in except for on Thursday evening. I called and they were like, you need to come in on Friday. So I went in on Friday and ended up just sitting there until about like 2 p.m. when they dismissed all of us. And they said we didn't need to come back on Monday. They picked their jurors. So it's so funny because my boyfriend actually got jury duty last month and was put on a case. So like, what are the chances that we both got jury duty? But anyway, that was my day all day yesterday and Friday. And then Thursday, I was over at the house with my mom and the designer and the movers, just kind of like hanging out there. I think I did get some clips from Thursday. It is now Saturday morning. We're gonna continue this vlog. As you can see, I'm all ready to go because we are about to head out for the Miami Notre Dame game. I'm so excited. I'm going with obviously my whole family, Claire, Connor, Elizabeth came home, my parents, and then my boyfriend is coming. So I'm actually just waiting for him to pick me up. We're just going for the day there and back. Miami of Ohio played Notre Dame six years ago when we went to that game and they're playing again today. So we're probably gonna lose because Miami of Ohio does not have the best football team. If you're new here, I went to Miami, my older sister Claire and my younger sister is currently a senior there. And then my dad went to Notre Dame. So little house divided. And then my boyfriend is a Clemson fan and Clemson hates Notre Dame. So he's gonna be rooting for Miami today. And he has a cute little golf shirt. So. Go Red Hawks. This is what I'm wearing. I feel like I always get questions over on Instagram needing help on game day fits. And I will say this is a category. My mom and I talk about this with my sisters. That's pretty difficult. Like today it's going to be scorching. It's going to be super hot, but I didn't really want to wear shorts. So I have this cute Miami t-shirt that Elizabeth just picked up from the bookstore. I pulled out my little red Prada. It's the perfect little bag for Miami things. I wore this a lot in college and it's a crossbody so I can go hands free. Um, my Van Cleef, which is red, white pants, and then my super comfortable Madewell like little sneakers. And that's pretty much it. I have sunglasses, lipstick, a moisturizer, some powder, just some backup things. Um, for today but i'm gonna wait for my boyfriend and then we're gonna go from there but i'm so excited for today <laughs> 